Oh, here I'm trying to... <laughs> I can never get it right. Uh, sorry about that. I really apologize for this with limited time, and I blew it yet again. Uh, we're following a qualifier for the fabulous Max Spa's hot tub. $10,000. We're phoning Paul Gray this morning at Pickering, Ontario as a qualifier to uh, win this $10,000 spot. Got to 900 jets in it, not 51. Hi, is Paul there? It is. Hi, Tim. Hi, hi, Paul. It's Steve Anthony phoning from CP24 Breakfast. How are you this morning? Good morning, Steve. I'm very good, thank you. Good. Are you fully awake? Yes, oh, I am. Okay. Uh, have you ever been in a hot tub? Uh, yes, I have, uh, actually. Des describe that experience to me, would you? Uh, it's uh, very soothing. Very relaxing. Yeah, you sound like you're falling asleep. Stay awake while you're doing that because I know how soothing you're, you're thinking about the times you were in it and how wonderful it was, right? Yes. Okay, can you imagine being in a hot tub with you and five good friends? Oh, that would be great. Okay, could you imagine 51 jets just... <laughs> that's the official sound for it. Could you imagine that? Could you imagine that? Yeah, yeah, that sound actually sounds pretty good. <laughs> Paul Gray, congratulations. You are the winner of a $10,000 Max Spas hot tub that folks at home can see at the National Home Show if they drop by. Paul, how are you? How are you? Do you are you going to be phoning up five friends right now? Are you going to, when you finally get this, just uh, be in it by yourself? Well, I got my four family members who just heard the phone ring. So. <laughs> Paul, we're very, very happy for you. All right. Um, so, uh, again, uh, you're the winner of the hot tub. Uh, and congratulations. It's Paul Gray, ladies and gentlemen. Big round of applause for Paul Gray. Here, once again, is that hot tub, which you can see yourself at the National Home Show if you want to go down. It's on display. All right. Uh, a man at the center of the Maple Leaf Garden sex abuse scandal back in court today. We'll have that story and the front pages of the newspaper when we get back. This is CP24 Breakfast.